Hey guys, it's time to do a speed test comparison between the OnePlus 3T on the right making its debut uh, on the speed test battle here versus the Mate 9. So let's just quickly boot uh, both of these two awesome phones at the same time. Here we go. And let's see which one will be faster in the round one, uh, the boot up session we have. So um, we do get Snapdragon 821 with the new 3T. And uh, the Mate 9, of course, is coming with the Kirin 960 processor, uh, which is also really, really fast. Plus 4 gigs of RAM versus 6 on the OnePlus 3T. So you can see 3T is faster in booting up, beating the OnePlus, uh, I mean the Mate 9 here. Uh, and that was a close battle. So I'm just going to quickly connect to the same Wi-Fi network. Everything is closed up in the background, so we're just going to start off uh, with the first application that is Phone Dollar. Here we go. Okay, so that was pretty fast on both phones. Again, you guys are the judge here. Next, we got settings. Here we go. Okay, so uh, feels like both phones were about the same. And uh, let's move on towards some third-party stuff. So uh, first off, we'll be launching uh, the Subway Surfer game here real quick. 3, 2, 1, boom and see which one is going to be faster let's see here okay mate 9 finishes up first followed by the one plus 3t so um first here game win for the mate 9 uh let's launch smash hit uh three two one go and let's see which one will be faster here one plus 3t faster followed by the mate 9 so Moving on, uh, we got Gunfu Do Boom. And it is super fast on the OnePlus 3T. Let's go back and uh, check out another game that is going to be Color Switch. Here we go. And let's see here. Okay, so I think the Mate 9 started this game a bit quicker there. So, uh, moving on, we got the Viber application. Go. Uh, that felt a bit quicker on the on the OnePlus 3T. WhatsApp. Again, a bit quicker on the OnePlus 3T. Next, so we got the Instagram. And, okay. Uh, the uh, Mate 9, definitely faster here with the latest feed. So, uh, let's go back and uh, check out Twitter. So going in three, two, one, and that is faster on the Mate 9. So I have to say these phones are uh, really close. They're going back and forth, and uh, I mean top-notch performance on both phones without a doubt. So uh, we're gonna launch the camera and see which one can uh, bring that up faster. So uh, here we go. So I think Mate 9 was quicker there. So again, uh, both phones are super fast. You're not going to be noticing differences between these two phones in real life usage wise. Uh, so moving on towards the browser test for that, I'll be using Google Chrome on both of these two phones. So first off, we got the Wikipedia website here. Three, two, one, go and see which one will be faster in loading up and finishing up first. So it seems like Mate 9 is done, followed by OnePlus 3T again, pretty close competition. And uh, scrolling is uh, super smooth on both phones. Obviously, uh, no chance for lag. So uh, I'm going to quickly go back and launch another website. That is going to be this one, facebook.com. Okay, let's try this. And this time, OnePlus 3T finished off first followed by the Mate 9. So I'm going to go back quickly and uh, do a quick RAM management test here and see which one is good here if we have any kind of refresh. So 6 gigs of RAM on the 3T versus 4 on the Mate 9. So you can see the, the phone dollar loaded up without any problem on both devices. We got settings, even Stevens. Let's see, uh, first game, Subway Surfer in the memory and wow look at this performance both phones are top 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 notch when it comes to ram management and we got smash hit no chance for refresh same thing over here let's uh go back 
and open up Gunfu that is also kept in the memory same thing on the Mate 9 let's uh, open the last game that we opened that is the color switch same thing on the Mate 9 and let's quickly go into Wiber that is also kept in the memory so really there is no chance for a refresh on either of these two phones so super super fast performance they were back and forth and really I mean the differences were uh, were pretty close and like I said you won't be noticing them in the real life usage so uh, promising performance if you buy these phones they're gonna um, you, they're gonna be fast and they're gonna last for for years for at least two years so super awesome fast android devices here mate 9 oneplus 3t hope you guys have enjoyed it i'll also be doing a separate video um giving you guys a quick camera comparison and talk about some other other stuff between these two phones so if you guys are interested in that let me know and uh, yeah see you in the next one peace